Hi guys, this is Ellie and today we're going to do a tutorial on how to make a paper turkey chew stuffer for your hamster. It's made of safe paper material and there will be treats inside for your hamster to enjoy. So first thing you need to do is gather your materials. What you will need is one, a paper towel tube or a toilet paper roll. Any size will do, I just chose a small size. The second thing you'll need is scissors. Next, you'll need um, some red soy paper or red paper. I chose to use red soy paper because I know it's safe for my hamster. And then the fourth thing you'll need is some non-toxic glue. I just got typical Elmer's school glue. And then the fifth thing you'll need is a paper towel. I ripped it in half because you don't need the whole sheet. And then the sixth thing you'll need is your hamster's favorite treats. In Marcy's case, it's sunflower seeds. The seventh thing that you'll need and last will be plain white printer paper. So the first step, you're going to take your paper roll, flatten it on one side. Make sure you only do it on one side though, the other side you want to keep it round as you can. So keep the other side unflattened and one side flattened. And then next, you're going to take your scissors and cut in a diagonal shape, kind of like a triangle, down the side of the flattened side. You don't want to cut it all the way, you just want to cut part way. Next, you're going to fold that tip that you cut out into a little crane head, like you would for an origami crane. To do this, you just push the tip downwards into a triangle shape and then fold it in, like so. The fifth step, you're going to cut on the top side some, two, some slits on the side of the paper towel tube. You're going to have a total of two of them. So as you can see, you don't want to cut all the way to the bottom, you just want to make slits. And this is how it should look like. So far so good. If you guys have any questions, you can always pause the video and rewind. So next you're going to put your turkey roll aside and then take out your feather template and you're going to make some feathers out of the white plain piece of paper. So you're going to place your template on the paper, trace out the feather, and then take your scissors and cut them out. Once you cut them out, you can fan the feathers out and then glue them together. I made a total of three. You can choose as many feathers as you want. Once you glue them, you can add some frills. This is optional. I just added a few to make it a little bit more fun. Next step, you will want to make the waddle out of the red soy paper. What you do is you just fold it in half and then cut a thin heart shape near the fold. So you get this opening flap-like contraption. Then you're going to place a small dab of glue on the flap and then close it. And now you can slide that waddle onto your turkey head. Like so. And there you go. You got your turkey head all ready to go. Next, you're going to take the feathers and you're going to slide them into the slits that you made earlier. And this is how it should look like. Now you're going to take your paper towel and place your favorite hamster treats in the center of your towel. Marcy's favorite is the sunflower seeds. Then you're going to wrap them into a tight bundle and stuff it into the turkey. Gobble gobble!
Now you can put it in your hamster cage for them to enjoy. If you guys have any questions, please feel free to leave a comment below. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed the tutorial, and I hope your hamster enjoys their Thanksgiving treat. Thanks for tuning in, guys. Happy Thanksgiving! Mm.